Hi, this is Mark Rinker from Silver Seas Yachts in Seattle. Today I'd like to take you through some of the key features of our 2020 Cantius 46 from Cruisers Yachts. Starting here from the dock, you get a first impression of how large the swim platform is on the 46 Cantius. Um, some of the key features are the integrated chocks, uh, so we can handle just about any dead rise or shape of tender. Um, retractable 50 amp shore power cord. A really, really generous space here for lines, fenders, and stowing window covers with another access uh, lower if you wanted to put just lines uh, in below. Of course, this is access for the grill. And then the integrated steps. So when you're using the remote control and lowering and raising the swim platform, you can walk up and down these steps as you retrieve the tender. So as we make our way on up into the cockpit, one of the first things that you'll notice, there is a walk around to both sides. Makes it really handy if you're running lines and fenders for the trip. And all of the controls for lights and systems are here on the starboard side. One touch of the make fast shade button and it quietly goes about its cantilever storage. Everything outside the boat or outside the cabin actually which saves space inside the cabin. So let's head on forward. Real nice walk around with handrails. And then we find ourselves forward and looking at the lounge chairs and the table. Here we have storage for the windlass, the washdown, spotlight, and a really nice stainless plow anchor. Some of the other accessories that you'll notice on the boat, including Volvo DPS for the dynamic positioning system. One of the key features of any Cruiser's Yachts product is its engine room. Cruiser's prides itself in a very well organized and labeled engine room. It doesn't matter where you are, if you have access to a marina or a marine repair facility they will be able to troubleshoot any of the systems while finding documentation and labeling and just a very, very organized method to everything on the boat. Typical entry to the salon area would be accomplished here with this center door retracted to starboard. The design is flexible, however, and allows us to slide all of the doors to port. So when we are entertaining using the cockpit, we end up with wide open views from really the windshield to the aft seating, everybody on one level. The galley, again, facing forward, just lots of light, lots of natural light that makes its way into the boat. The seating for guests while underway is really nice. It's up high where you can see, help watch for logs forward. It's actually a little bit higher than the captain gets over here. And this also converts to bedding overnight in case you wanted to put... Um, 
another guest or two up top. We've got the swivel uh, flat screen TV, all the entertainment controls, refrigerator, freezer, lots of storage to port. We have uh, two burners. Really, really nice deep stainless sink. Convection microwave. The helm station has been really redesigned and is very pretty with uh, the Garmin glass cockpit. All of the controls easily at hand. Another cell phone charging station, which is kind of nice. All the latest features are incorporated, including Volvo joystick, steering, docking, DPS. It's a very well laid out helm station. And everybody on one level for one conversation. Starting here in the hallway, I just wanted to stop at the power panel and view how well laid out and labeled a cruiser's yachts um, panel is. To starboard, we have what would be both the day head as well as access to the VIP forward. Got nice hanging lockers on both sides. Flat screen TV and controls for HVAC. And the Rockford Fosgate stereo. Another hanging locker. These are all the uh, mats for the cockpit that are stored here. By moving washer dryer combo down into the master and pick up some really nice storage for towels. We're walking right past the in-suite head right now. We'll come back to that. But this is really the jewel of the 46 Cantius is this mid-master stateroom with lounger nice place to watch the news and drink a cup of coffee listen to the radio to starboard we have a really large set of chest of drawers and the washer dryer so you throw the towels in and you take a nap this is the Midmaster in suite head. I'm six feet tall. When I step into the shower, I have at least three more inches of headroom. And I walked right past hanging storage which has all of the Coast Guard kit hiding in it. So that's it for today. A quick walkthrough of the 2020 Cruisers Cantius 46. Thank you for coming along. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. We'll be happy to answer them.